when using Excel, sometimes we need to copy data from a website, or for some engineering students, they need to pull out data results from some analytical software, so they can analyze the data and use the data to generate plots in Excel. For example, I have a set of data that I want to copy and paste it into Excel. Copy and paste. However, as you can see, it will show in one column together instead of being separated into several columns. This looks very messy, and this is not what we want. There is a way to solve this problem. So first, we need to select all of the data, and then we go to the Data tab, click on this Text to Columns icon. Make sure the first one is selected, click Next. In this example, the data is all separated with commas. So under the delimiters, we just uncheck the tab box. But we check this comma box. As you can see in the preview of selected data, the Excel has already figured out where to separate the data. Just click Finish, and you can see the texts have been separated into four columns. This is pretty easy. The important thing is we need to have some delimiter in our data so we can convert it into columns. Sometimes we also need to switch the rows and columns on a table. To do this, first of all, we need to select this table, right-click, copy, and then go to a new cell. This is where I want to paste the reverse. Right-click again, paste the special, paste the special. Make sure the transpose is checked. Hit OK. So now, as you can see, the columns and the rows have been reversed.